really excited to show you guys the new sail through integration for Digio. And uh, if you're new to Digio, I want to show you kind of what we do. And so I have a few ideas of, of that I put together uh, on this demo page. So this is like the welcome wall. And these are just a few of the many features that we have. But this is a welcome wall. For example, we can do a takeover light box so people can enter their email. And um, they can also easily close out of this and, and go back to the site. Another one is um, we call it exit intent. So this only shows up when people are leaving the site. And all this is really easy to set up and design, and it's a full managed solution as well. And I'm going to show you guys that in a second. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to show you quick features that most people use this for, especially in e-commerce. This is when the browser, if you guys saw that my mouse cursor left the page, and this kind of gets triggered. Really good for e-commerce. We can also do things with an exit time. We can also determine the cart value or how many items are on the cart. And based on that, we can put in logic to do an exit intent or not, or, or show a different type of uh, offer. In this case, we did free shipping. Um, and so that was exit intent. Um, we have QA widget. This is really cool for for people uh, that are kind of uh, small businesses or have products that are way over a certain price range. Um, uh, so this is on a scroll percentage. So I scroll down a percentage uh, percentage of the page, and this is kind of this could be like a picture of you, and they can ask a question. This is not live chat where you get you know someone has to be there constantly. This is just an email that we send to notify you. This is really good for for things that are above a certain price point or are very custom, like it's a customized product that people have a lot of questions on. Typically, we see people using this when the when the price is a little over five hundred dollars. Um, and then we also have this mobile banner, which is really popular on mobile phones. I can't show you that because I'm on a, on a mobile device. So I'll show you the sticky banner on a desktop. And the reason why I keep showing it on a uh, kind of in incognito tab is we have all these rules based on cookie values and session values to make sure that we're not annoying the end visitor. So this is a sticky banner, and it shows up on a three-second timer. And it could be pushed at the top or the bottom of the page. It's very flexible, and it kind of fans out across the entire page. And then you can also set rules around how it shows up and, and what happens and make it above the fold or, or below. Uh, I'm going to kind of get into the actual product. It's it's really we have lots of themes, over 300 new themes, and we're almost launching five or ten more. When you when you do sign up, we actually can uh, design a few themes based on your site. So we have things like yes no boxes. We have things like hey target based on location. So if you're doing a free shipping offer, only show it up in the United States. Um, we have things like sliders. We can do redirects. So you know maybe an exit survey, for example. Uh, and the list is pretty endless. Uh, what you can do raffles. Um, you can do all sorts of things, you know, click the call, a um, lot of chat widgets. Now, each theme is fully customizable as well. I'm going to kind of go into the ones, our pre-made ones that I kind of showed you and kind of show you how, how easy it is to set things up. Uh, so this is a sticky banner. So everything is, is drag and drop, for example, like that. Um, everything can be easily changed. You can, we can achieve any color and font value that you have. So if you guys have brand requirements, that's very easy to set that up. Um, I want to jump ahead and, and let me just show you like this exited 10, of course. So every single theme that I showed you is easy customizable as well. So here's one that we created. Again, everything is drag and drop. We can upload your own background image. Um, it's extremely fast if you're worried about speed, extremely fast. Yeah, we're actually running the, top, the biggest sites in the world, a little over 10% of the top 1,000 websites. And we have lots of small business owners that use this as well. Um, and our flagship product, and I can't go over the everything today but uh, on this video, uh, but what is cool is that these conditions, so for example, I can go to this condition and we could target people very differently. In this case, I have this URL property, so we could say, hey, I only want to target people that are on the cart page. Like we could target people based on you know, what device they're on. Um, other rules are we could target people based on the number of times they've been to my sites. So maybe we only want to target you know, first time visitors. Uh, we could target people based on you know, when did they last view our site. We could target people based on like keywords. Another cool thing that we have is dynamic personalization. So based on the referring source, or based on text on the site, or based on the keyword they're coming in from, we could change the light box and, and auto place uh, text inside the light box based on those keyword values. Values. It's extremely powerful, high converting tool. Um, also, these are all our triggers. There's a lot. The, the list is pretty endless of how you can target and what you can do. Um, we also have the ability to write custom JavaScript inside your account. So we could you know, trigger goals inside your analytics system. We could uh, read text and, and do a very sophisticated set of triggers around your, your cart value. Um, and of course, these all work together in conjunction with each other. Uh, so that way, you know, if they see like a welcome wall, they won't see the exit intent. You, you can set really easily set rules like that up. We have A/B testing, multivariate testing. Of course, you want you want sophisticated tools for testing to make sure you're you're converting at a high amount. So, and then we also have a full analytics dashboard. Now let's get into the integrations. I already set up the integration before this call, but let's say I didn't set this up. Um, 
we click a new integration, and then you just click, you just pick sail through right here, and then we kind of take you through an OAuth flow. And I have a screenshot of that, um, I believe. So I'll just we'll just do this, and then you just enter in your API key and secret, and this can be found in your sail through account, or feel free to uh, contact your sail through rep. Um, once you add this in. Um, you'll see a, a, cho a choose list option here. And this will pull in all the lists that you have. So you just click this, and the next screen you'll see all your lists, and you just pick which list. And you just do that a few times if you want to connect to multiple lists, because you can actually have Digio uh, submit an email to multiple lists or just uh, one list at a time. So you can have different light boxes that go to different lists. Um, and so then what we do is we just click the this edit button on the integrations and say, hey, we just want to add to this specific list that we just created. Uh, and that's the integration, and that's Digio. Uh, let us know if you have any questions. We're always happy to help. We're very hands-on.